Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys, peep game. All right, here comes the fake outrage again. Here comes the so-called fake outrage towards LeBron James. As much as LeBron James gets criticized by me and other people, sometimes, or should I say a lot of times, I have to defend LeBron James. Because at the end of the day, a lot of times people just be reaching, and a lot of times people will try to use something a, a, a quote that isn't that bad to try to capitalize off something to bring notoriety to themselves. Keep in mind, Deshaun Jackson was cleared of all possible criminal uh, prosecution because despite all the accusations against him, they didn't have enough to file criminal charges. Now, what happened is the backstory behind this is all that happened was we know that Deshaun Watson, who has the right to continue his football career, despite the the civil lawsuits against him. And a lot of you morons don't fucking know the difference between a civil lawsuit and a criminal case. OK, we all know the backstory. And there was a lot of reasons to raise your eyebrows in behind these accusations towards Deshaun Watson in the first place. And I'm going to make this very clear. I don't believe all women and for people that's trying to say, well, LeBron need to be sensitive. All the man said was, yes, sir. When he found out that Deshaun Watson is going to Cleveland and all of a sudden it just sparked all this outrage. So the man can't be happy for the dude trying to continue and move on with his football career. Man, fuck y'all and y'all fake outrage and take this however you want for people that are sitting up there saying, well, I got a daughter and LeBron got a daughter. Fuck your daughter. Now what? Like your daughter can't be a lying bitch. Get the fuck out of here with that fake shit. Take that however you want. Because I get tired of this fake outrage crap. I mean, at the end of the day, man, Deshaun Jackson, is, I mean, excuse me, Deshaun Watson has a right to move on with his life. See, this is the thing that pisses me off. This is what I'm saying. Anytime a black dude, whether it's proven that he's innocent or it may be proven later on he might be a little guilty or somewhat guilty. He's guilty no matter what. If he's accused, he's automatically presumed guilty by the court of public opinion or the court of public white opinion. Because if a white dude think you did it or a white person think you did it, you did it. No matter how much evidence is presented that you're innocent. Look what happened with Chris Brown. Not just once, not twice, but a few times. And it's been proven every time that the chick been lying. No, you don't have to believe all women. And more than likely, the person that came up with that fake cliche was probably some goofy ass white chick. Now, like I said before, if you have been a victim of this, yeah, I do feel for you. But I'm not going to sit up there and believe you just because you a woman and you say that happened to you. You have to prove it. You have to prove it in court or you just have to prove it, period. No, I'm not going to say that the person that you're accusing is guilty just because you a woman. No. And once again, I don't believe all women. But once again, this is just people bitching just to be bitching and trying to bring uh, notoriety to themselves. And I'm just keeping it a buck because at the end of the day, I'm getting kind of sick of it. Now, well, I'm not getting I am sick of this stuff. Whether we like LeBron, semi like LeBron, you know what I'm saying? The man have a right to his opinion. And it just amazes me. He can't win for losing. At the end of the day, a lot of times people use celebrities to try to bring notoriety to themselves. And most of the time, LeBron don't even respond to this stuff. Ask Kobe Kobeton when he tried to start a fake beef with LeBron. Ask Ask the boys in blue when they was trying to start a beef with LeBron. I guarantee you the same thing going to happen with, with Kyle Rennenhaus. LeBron is not going to respond. He doesn't respond to that. He has, for the most part, the same mentality I have. Don't give nobody free publicity. Don't mention a name. Ignore it. And this is just another situation that's going to be ignored. And if I'm LeBron, I wouldn't pay attention to it. Because once again, this is just fake outrage. 
anyway, this your boy Town Biz, and I'm out.